how to use an audio software uh, to switch between audio devices. Uh, many of you know who have a headset and have a surround sound system that you switch between. It's a pain in the ass to constantly use the control panel to set one to default, set one to uh, active, and back and forth every time you want to switch between your headset and your speakers. So I found a little program called Audio Switch and what it does is it allows me to switch between the two devices using the hotkey which makes things a whole lot easier. So what you would do is you would download the software. I recommend using the Major Geeks link. You can see there's a new version of the software coming out in some time. It doesn't really say, but it doesn't really matter because the original one does exactly what we want it to do on all versions of Windows. So you download the software and then you would be presented with this file here, audio switcher.exe. Put it wherever you want, somewhere that you're not going to accidentally delete it or you don't really need to run it anyway. So you're going to run it once and once it's set up you'll never have to use it again. So after you run it you'll be presented with this screen right here and you'll see all your devices and all your recording devices and uh, that's basically it. Now you jump into the settings. So you want it to close the tray so that it stays in the tray. You want it to start when Windows starts so you don't have to launch it every time. You want it to start minimized so that you don't have to see it and minimize it every time. And uh, show disabled devices and show default device and tray. So if this is off it just shows a music icon. This of course as you know you can drag wherever you want. And uh, with it on you can actually see which device you're currently actively using. Okay, once that's set up, you go hotkeys. You'd add both your devices, your speakers, and your headset. You set hotkeys, nothing too complicated, but not simple enough that you'll accidentally switch between them just in everyday use. And once you're done, that's about it. You hit minimize, and you can switch between your devices using your hotkeys back and forth without any kind of menu opening or configuration. It'll start when Windows starts, and you'll never have to really go back into it again. So I'll put the uh, link for this software in the description of the video, and uh, you guys can have fun using it.